Got to the marsh at a quarter to three Eight other rigs and we're in the lead Been scouting that hole for about two weeks I know right where I'm going, time to make them bleed Gonna wait till they drop from the heavens just right Me and my buddies and my dog at my side I love living life with my eyes to the sky As waterfowl season comes to a close, I got the opportunity to go out and see all the fun hunters get to have. But it's not all fun and games. There's a lot of hard work that goes into having a successful hunt. Senior Ian Wolf will tell you what goes into setting up in the morning. Drive a four-wheeler out there, drop all our decoys off, and uh, set up all the decoys, that's about it. Set up the layout line. After setting up everything, it becomes a waiting game. But there are some tricks to call in the geese. It's kind of, you're really just trying to imitate what they would sound like on the ground. I mean, you don't want to call too much at them, uh, but you don't want to call too little because you want to maintain their interest and keep them focused on you. You don't want to let them get distracted by the dog. Alright, so really when the birds, when they're coming to you, it's because they're hungry and they're waiting to eat. So, usually they're looking for parties to eat with. So, you give them like, the geek boys, you have like, it looks like it's safe. He's flying over. Um, so you're called out of them, like, hey, it's safe down here to eat. And they're like, they'll come down, see what's going on. And that's what you're going to do. And then the geek boys. It's kind of complicated, but if they're kind of close, you don't call as hard. And then if they're far away, you kind of call a little bit more aggressively. And hopefully they come in. Waterfall hunting is way different than other types of hunting, and it seems like these hunters enjoy it more. Um, it's not like deer hunting where you have to really sit still and be quiet the whole time. You uh, can kind of talk and then joke around, you know, and then it's just a lot of fast-paced, like, action. Uh, with, like, sports. When people are getting close to scoring a point, they get the adrenaline rush. I feel like when birds start coming through, you're cool and you hear them whistling, and calling back at you, you're like, oh, here we go, we're in, we got stuff going on now. People may think hunting looks easy because people are just shooting things, but it's not as easy as it looks. Um, I mean, right before they're about to land, because the, they've slowed down so much from when they're flying, they're just hovering above your decoys, they're going to be the slowest, and uh, you can probably do your job. Hunting is a sport that's hard to get into by yourself. Usually you learn from a family member or a close friend. I started waterfowl hunting when uh, one of my friends introduced it to me about four or five years ago. And ever since that I got hooked on it. It's probably my favorite type of hunting, or it is my favorite type of hunting. That took me for the first time when I was, I think, three or four. And then I kind of shot my first deer when I was eight and just started hunting from there. Kind of moved up and started hunting on my own when I was 12 or 13. So, uh, I started uh, duck hunting when I was in eighth grade. And uh, my friends Ian introduced me to it. So I just kind of started going with them because my dad wasn't really a big duck hunter or anything. So I just kind of realized that it was a lot of fun. Well, my grandpa started me goose hunting, and my brother really got me into duck hunting. Going hunting for the first time was a fun learning experience. These boys are highly dedicated to the sport, which makes the experience even better. I will definitely want to go again soon. <laughs> He didn't shoot the best, but no. he got it on the first shot. Welcome to the drop zone, got you in the crosshairs. Once I pull this trigger, they're gonna haul you out of here. Hunting is a lifestyle, survival of the fittest. We on a hunt, what you want? Come on, now you in a drop zone. Down, exhale, one shot. One kill, we do it like this all day. 
drops on y'all, we don't play. We chase them big old hogs, big trucks with over dogs. It's all American to hunt and tow the gun. Climb up in that tree stand, got a muzzle loader in my hand. Big buck walking into sight, game over, drops on good night. We hunt them grizzly bears, Kodiaks, blacks and browns. Wanna see what the drop zone is?